I'll jump into Nick's power rankings. Okay. So who are your power rankings of the week? We already know who number one is. We're gonna stay. At, uh, we're staying at number nine first. We're going nine first. We're gonna stay at Edmonton. Zero and seven. They don't get a win. They're playing bad football. Um, uh, maybe this new quarterback gives them a spark this week. Felt like he's gonna get the start. Trade for it. Um, they stay at nine. Number eight, Winnipeg. Got to move them down. Not playing good ball. Not playing complimentary football. Their O line is freaking terrible. Give up five sacks. Zach Claro's on his back all day. They're playing like shit. Playing like shit, and it is what it is. Their O-line is crappy. Four or five of them is terrible, and that's why the quarterback's on his back. They can't do long developing plays because Zach has no time. It's not that Zach is, is a bad quarterback. He still could play. He still could throw the ball with the best of them. But when you have no time and you have to throw shorter routes and they can move the ball up and down the field, but they can't score touchdowns or they find a way to turn it over. Man, did, you, not- did you play with any of these offensive linemen? Yes, I did. Okay. It is what it is, man. I got to call na- it. Na- na- name them. I'll they're tag them on this one. They're playing bad. It is what I'll it is. I'll tag them, though. I mean, come I mean, on. I don't have to call them out. They know who they are. I don't know who they are. It's four I mean, out of five of them. It's four out of five of them. It's playing <laughs> bad. So anybody so else. Who's, who's not playing bad? Stanley Bryant, he's still orchestrating. He's not playing great either. I, I <laughs> really. That's my guy. I love him to death. But he's not playing great either. But he's not playing as bad as the rest of them. They, some of them, they can't even move. They can't move laterally. They can't oh, go together. They're not making their reads right. They're letting people come in on blitzes, and they're not switching off of, of – they're running They're running um, stunts on them, and they can't pass it off correctly. They're just bad as a so, unit on the O-line. Uh, according to Charles Barkley, they're terrible. They're okay. terrible on the O-line. They mm-hmm. have to do something better. This is a team that's been – known for having great old line play and pushing the other teams around. And that's what a, a standard of, of Winnipeg old line. And that's just not what's happening right now. And I could call it like I see it. I hate it to, to oh, say yeah. it, what it is. Number seven. Number seven, we got Hamilton. They got two wins in a row. They're two wins in a row. They're looking better. They're two and five. Bo Levi Mitchell um, throwing a lot of touchdowns this year. He's playing well this year. People thought he was done. They written him off a few years ago, but He's but he's back and he's balling. He's doing his thing. He's not the problem over there. When they do lose, it's usually the defense. But their special teams is is giving them some short fields also. Um, who we got at number six? Um, a big drop for Calgary, man. I I, I had to drop them a couple spots. They they came out and they laid an egg. I I did not like their effort. I did not like how they came out. So lethargical, lazy looking, and 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 bad from the whole front. Looked like the offense and the offense led to the defense playing bad and the special team. Um, Toronto at five. I got them right behind Ottawa at four. Ottawa's been rolling five and two. Man, they're turning it around over there. It's nothing. It's a great atmosphere when you win in the Ottawa. Those fans come out to support you, win, lose, or draw, and they're finally getting a team that's winning back again because they were a team that was going to championships and great cups for most of my time of playing between 2015 and 2000. And, in 19, and, and then they fell off real big time. But good for them. They're winning again. Shout out to Bobby Dice. I love him. That's my guy. Um, at number three, BC, they had a bye week, so I keep them at three. Sass goes to falls down to two, and Montreal claims their spot back at number one. There we have it, folks. We have Montreal, Sass, BC, Ottawa, Toronto, Calgary, Hamilton, Winnipeg and their trash can offensive line, and Edmonton rolls at number nine with their own, I think, Owen seven record. Yeah, um, can't, can't you know? Can't uh, what's the word? They can't uh, can't lay it on a whorehouse on Friday night on payday. Can't get it. Can't get laid <laughs> in a whorehouse on payday. Got so it. 